Spurgeon here with Revzilla TV to talk to you about the GV Monokey Trekker cases available at Revzilla.com. So the GV Trekker lineup is a super versatile line of cases from GV, ranging from 33 and 46 liter side cases that can also be used as top cases. And for those of you out there that want the maximum storage, they have a 52 liter top case only as well. This is me for you guys out there on touring bikes as well as adventure bikes. But if you're looking at this stuff and you think, hey, I want to add this, the first thing you need to figure out is whether or not GV has a racking system for your specific motorcycle. So start with our bike finder. And what you're looking for is the PL or the PLR monokey racks. PLR simply stands for rapid release. So if you're someone out there that's only going to have these bags on your bike maybe two or three trips out of the year, Go with the rapid release racks because in a matter of minutes, it allows you to take those racks off of your bike and it doesn't look like there's anything actually there. If you're someone that's going to be using these all the time, you can go ahead and go with the regular PL racks. Now, if you've used the bike finder, you've found out that these racks will fit your bike, let's move forward with installation. Install for these, it's going to be a one out of three on our BSD, our beard scale difficulty for installation. You're looking at about a half an hour to an hour in the garage to get the racks installed and once the racks are on there, it's a push of a button to get the bags on and off. We'll talk more about install at the end, but for right now, let's jump in and talk about what sets the Trekker series apart from some of the other racks out there in GV's lineup. So GV's been around for 35 years. They're a premier luggage company from OEM to aftermarket. They've really developed the brand for themselves around the quality of the products they design. So what you're going to see with the Trekker lineup is it's going to be a combination of plastic as well as aluminum to give you all the functionality of both and it's also going to be really versatile in the features you get with this. So like I said in the beginning, the 33 and the 46 liter cases, you're going to be able to use those as side cases as well as a top box case depending on how you want to configure it. So let's start by breaking those down. On my right hand side we've got the one that's done all in black and you're also going to have silver options as well. So to get this opened up, you're going to have one main button. You push the button, and then you've got two safety latches on each side. You're going to pop those latches open, and then it's just as easy as that. You're going to pop those latches open, and then once you pop this up in a briefcase style, you're going to see it's that double wall plastic construction. You are going to have a rubberized gasket to make this as waterproof as possible. If you really have a delicate item that you need to be super waterproof, I'd probably recommend putting that in a waterproof bag, like a camera or something like that. But overall, you're going to get a lot of water resistance with this. You're also going to have these nice attachment straps to keep the lid from flopping open and smashing into the ground. I've had some issues with OEM cases that didn't have this, and I've actually done some damage to the lid of the case. So the fact that GV puts that on there, nice upgrade. You're also going to have a nice elasticated stretch strap that goes across just to help you pack the entire thing together. Now, here is where the Trekker is really going to excel. Let's close this for a second and move over to the bag that I have mounted on my BMW. So let's say you have this on there, you've got all your luggage together, and you don't want to go ahead and open up the whole side case so that everything falls out. The Trekker allows you to partition that off via a unique hinge system that you're going to see here. You simply slide that open, and as long as you have it configured where the whole side isn't going to open, you're allowed to access your bag from just the top. This is super innovative and no one else out there is doing it. GV gets a big thumbs up for me for redesigning this bag and I really like the way you can get to your stuff on top without having to have everything fall out. Now, like I said in the beginning, we got a 33 and we got a 46 liter case that can be used as side cases or a top case. If you're someone out there that needs the maximum storage possible, GV does have a 52 liter top case option. This is a behemoth. This is super huge. You can fit two full size extra large helmets in here. The only downside to this, you can't use it as a side case. And that's not really a downside. It's almost too big. You wouldn't want to use it as a side case. But again, keep in mind with the 33 and the 46, you can use them either or. With the big 52 liter, that's a one and done. Now, the next step is to figure out how you want to configure your bike. With the BMW on my left hand side, it's got a left mounted exhaust. So what I did was I actually put a 33 liter case on the left, I put a 46 case on the right, and then I put the big 52 liter up on top. So once you have your configuration sorted out, you're looking at a one out of three on our BSD, our beard scale of difficulty for installation. Starting with the side cases, you're looking at half an hour to an hour in the garage using simple hand tools. On my Beamer on the left hand side, it took me a half an hour and I was ready to roll. Now, for those of you riders out there that want to throw a top box on there as well, you have two main options. First and foremost, if you've got no luggage rack on your bike, you simply need to get the GV racks as well as the mounting plate for it. If you've already got a luggage rack on there, what you want to do is you can get a simple adapter plate. 
For example, I've got an alt rider plate on here. I got an adapter plate, 15 minutes, and I was ready to roll out and enjoying my ride. So I think GV did a great job with this. They knocked out of the park and they've thrown a lot of features in their Trekker lineup that you don't see from any other manufacturer. There's a lot of folks out there rocking GV products on their motorcycles. If you wanna hear more about what they have to say, do me a favor, click below. Read other riders' opinions about the GV gear they're rocking on their personal setups. If you have more questions for us, never hesitate. Get us on the phone, give us a call, 877-792-9455, or simply type us out an email, cs at Thank you for joining us for this look at the GV Trekker cases. I'm Spurge. Enjoy the ride.